hello guys welcome back to the channel in this video i'm going to show you how to fix windows update failed error when i install any update in my windows 11 version 24h2 so you can see error kb5048667 install error 0x800f0815 so let's get started we need this option I want to help make the installation better while installation of Windows 11. Go to this PC and go to local disk C and create a new folder over here. Right click and go to new folder. Type here Windows in big word W I N D O W S and 11 so do not use space okay do not use space double one and press enter now go to your iso file so this is my iso open it and this is my disk image file right click and mount and copy these uh, files with setup copy and paste here new folder open it and paste here wait for some time while copy and paste now go back and windows 11 now guys close it and go to search bar on your windows and type here cmd and go to command prompt right click and run as administrator now now copy this command you can see so do not use space because i i did not use a space in my windows uh, folder so copy this uh, command close it and right click and go to edit and paste so local disk c so i did not use space windows 11 in windows 11 folder now now press enter wait for some time over here so you need to wait for some time over here if this does not work then press enter again on the keyboard so guys you can see install windows servers so guys you can use this command from my video description now check this box and click on next now you can see you need this option keep file settings and apps if you want to save your all data and apps then check this option and click on next now you can see install windows 10 pro and keep file settings and apps now click on install now i will be back after installation for windows 11 again so after installation for windows go to search bar in your windows and type here control panel control panel go to control panel and go to uninstaller program and view install updates we have no update go to windows and update click here and check for updates Now go to reinstall updates. So you can see uh, these updates already installed, but we need another update. So close it. Reinstall update and go to update Windows update and check for updates. Now you can see the update KB5048667. Now wait for some time over here. So it's done, you can see pending restart. Restart now. After restarting, go to control panel, open and go to uninstall a program and go to view install updates. So you can see the update KB5048667 successfully installed. 
So I hope this tutorial helps you and please subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.